Yes, I'm back. Back again. Johnny's back. With a haul. <laughs> no bad. Yeah, I'm back. For, with, with, not for, with a Morrison's haul. Woo! So, before I start this off, please give it a like. Please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell just to let you know every time I upload because I've been uploading a hell of a lot recently so yes thank you also as well to all my new subscribers and obviously to my 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 fans out there whatever you call them the people who'd already subscribed to me but anyway if you want to see what i've been can't words out if you want to see what i've been buying at morrison's this week then just continue to watch right so i'm going to do the things that are on the side first so we have got where have i put them things oh we left this um his bougie gucci hat i got him this for his birthday gucci hat it weren't cheap anyway so 24 if you can hear that squeaking in the background i bought rocky a dog toy and he came into the kitchen and just nicked it out of the bag which he always does he sniffs them out so yeah just trying to go back rocky shush good boy so, 24 cans of coke zero i'll pop that back over here then we also got I think it was 12 cans of Vimto Zero because Marcus prefers the Vimto. And Marcus took me today. Then we've got nine rolls of Oh So Soft bug roll aloe vera ones. There wasn't much toilet roll in there today. I don't know whether there's a shortage or whether they just hadn't stocked the shelves. I don't know. Then we've got a massive box of Kellogg's Craves 850 grams for £4 and if you bought the two boxes separately it was something like £5.50 so it worked out good but still £4 for cereal you can tell that Marcus was with me anyway also got some Cravendale fresher for longer semi skim milk because I, I just prefer this one I don't know why I just think it tastes a bit nicer Right. Back on. First thing, we've got some Smith chipstick salt and vinegar flavour, six in a pack. They were £1.25. So if I remember the, the prices, I'll tell you. So they were £1.25. We actually got two bags of these, the Doritos Flaming Hot Tangy Cheese flavour. I can't eat these, they're too spicy. Rocky. Fuff, fuff, fuff. I'll go open the door one minute. Right, so we've got the Doritos. I bought two bags of these, but Marcus has run upstairs with the other one. And he also got some Doritos salsa to go with them. So, yeah, it's, it's going to have a very hot mouth. And he took, I bought him a Lunchables as well. He's 20 years old. And his little snacky bits before dinner are Doritos and Lunchables. So he better eat his dinner because I'm making chicken wings. And my chicken wings are the best. This is another thing he's picked up as well, look, sneaking it in the trolley. Pringles, sour cream and onion. Then I picked up some of the raspberry trifles. They were, I think these were 165 on offer because they're normally 258. Um, these were 169 I think they were. I think they are slightly cheaper than Aldi because the Aldi ones are really nice, but these literally look exactly the same. I've got some of them. Um, I've run out of Oxo cubes, so I picked some of these up. So they were like one pound seventy-five for twelve, or two pound for twenty-four. So I thought I'll go for the twenty-four. I've got the cats. Some of these. These are the gourmet Mon Petit intense with turkey, chicken, and duck. 
and they were pound seventy-five. I've got two packs of the corn on the cob. And I think these were, I think these were one pound, I want to say one pound seventy, I think they were. Sorry if I'm wrong, but I'm, I'm pretty sure they were. I've got some button mushrooms. I can't remember how much these were, sorry. Big bag of carrots. These were 55p. Remember that one. Well. Got some tender stem broccoli. Can't remember how much this was. I think it might have been 195. I might be lying there. Oh. Mm. Got the usual Albert Bartlett red potatoes. Got some of them. I didn't get them. Marcus went and got them for me, so still not sure how much they were. Oh, I got some a bag of the brown onions. Green what they call they call the brown onions, don't they? Yeah, it's a normal bag of medium sized onions. These were one pound fifteen. These just ended up on the um conveyor belt um after i put my shopping on and these are the sort of things that izzy would have picked up and put on there for us to buy that so she could eat in the car so when i seen them on there marcus has said oh, i bet they've just fell off but i thought well they weren't over like stacked up or anything so i don't know how they did that but they, they're the sugar free ones it said there I've got to buy them because it just seems like she's, she's put them on there. I just, I had to buy them. But I don't think they're very expensive. This, on the other hand, is a bit of a bougie buy for fabric softener. It's the new one. It's the Noor Outdoorable Fresh As If Dried Outside Moonlight Lily. And I don't know whether you can tell by the bottle, but it's like... It's got like this pattern on it. If you can see that, it's like you can feel it. Um, 55 washes. So it's a big one. It's the 770 mil. It smells amazing. I had to buy it because it was new. I hadn't had it before. It smells absolutely beautiful. So I always smell them in the shops. I know you're probably not supposed to, but I do. And this was £5.50. It didn't even have a price on the on the shelf, but I thought I've got to get it. Five pound fifty. A bit wounded when I seen that, but I still bought it. Um, I've got some top tomatoes with garlic and onion. So this is just in one of those um, recyclable cartons. That was fifty five p. I've got a little tin of the Morrison's baked beans. I know we've got another little tin, so it's good to have the two. Um, this was 35p. Got some trim salad onions or spring onions, whatever you want to call them. Um, I think these were a pound or just under a pound. Got some of the, are they called roysters? Yeah, roysters bubble chips in the T-bone steak flavour. I get five bags and they were a pound. I've got some mature cheddar, just the Morrison's branded one. And this was 2 dollars And celery sticks. Uh, these are just the, the cut ones. I think these were a pound as well. And then Marcus when he got these, these are the uh, home chips straight cut and they're the reduced fat ones are the lighter ones he's trying to cut back even though he's got these snacks you know yeah that is the first bag bag done with so let's move on to the next one you know what i've just realized is one thing i definitely needed to get from shopping is bin bags because I bought bin bags from Aldi a couple of weeks ago. Normally their bin bags are really good, but I think they'd changed their supplier because um, these were like a different branded 
ones than they normally use. And first of all, they're really hard to separate. And a lot of them sort of tore a little bit. Um, but then you get to the end, say like five bin bags at the end that are meant to be five bin bags. And there's no bit to separate on. So it's just one long bin bag that's about two meters long. So I needed to get some bin bags and I forgot. I'm gonna have to go out tomorrow now and get some bin bags because I do need them. I'm using like carrier bags at the moment. I don't like using them, but it will have to do for the time being. Yum. So next one. I bought a little pot of double cream. This was 60p. I just bought this because we did get some strawberries in case we want to have strawberries and cream. Or if I make mashed potato, as you know, if you've watched my channel before, I always use double cream in my mashed potato. So bougie mash. I love the word bougie. You're going to wear that a lot if you're new here or if... Um, if you've watched my channel before, you, you're bound to have heard me say bougie, but bougie is my new word. Anyway, I've got some squares, six pack. These were 125. No, 150, these were. Marcus then appeared with these. These are the chili and garlic olives. Isabel used to love these as well. These were £3.50, they're normally £4. They do last quite a while um, and they've got like little chopped up chilli bits in them and she used to absolutely love these and she didn't even really like spicy chilli things but loved these ones. There's like chunky bits of chilli there look. Matthew loves them as well. I wish I loved olives because they're so good for you as a snack but I just don't like them. I don't know. It's annoying. But anyway. So another thing from Marcus is picked up some of these classic chicken flavour by Coley um, instant noodles. We've got two of them, um, and I think those were forty p each. And then he's picked up this chicken flavour by Shangri La chicken flavour noodles. I think they were thirty five p. I think I think that's all that's all his noodles. He loves his, his noodles and he makes like a soup broth with them as well. So they're a bit like um ramen noodles, you know, with the, the broth in it. Has his own chili and stuff, so very nice. Um then for Mark's lunch, he's just gone for these two single packs of um large white baps, they were fifty nine p each these burgers i've got these burgers um the other day from morrison's i did them i ordered them through the delivery that you can order um from morrison's on there and i just needed a couple of bits i just wanted something for dinner and we weren't feeling great but anyway i got these these are the best scotch beef quarter pounders you get four in a pack and i just thought yeah i'll get some of them in i forgot to get the brioche buns but i can always pick them up another time um, so yeah, these on brioche buns with a slice of burger cheese, you know, the the ones that come as, as a single one in, in that clear wrapper that's probably really bad for you, but it's great on burgers. And then I put some red onion, gherkins, and oh my god, I forgot sweet baby rays, barbecue sauce, that's why I wanted to go in Morrison's. What a waste of time. Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce, which is from America, and it is the best barbecue sauce. So if you haven't tried Sweet Baby Ray's, they sell it in Morrison's. It's beautiful. And I'm actually good. I didn't buy any, so we'll be taking a trip back there tomorrow. Anywho, they were... How much were they? I think it was 3 50 for them, but there's four in there. So I've got Matthew some Vitti Club Biscuits, these were a pound. Mark has picked up the um, Chocolate Digestives, I think these were on offer for one fifty, And I like them as well, you know I like my biscuits. I've got some Italian Mozzarella, um, I think this was 49p or 59p, something like that. Um, 
pack of strawberries so they were either 199 each or two for 350 but we we only normally eat the one box so i've just got the one and we also got some little plums i think these were about one pound 20 or something i think like that Marcus went and got some bacon when we were at the check out I, I said to him I forgot the bacon and I do normally go for streaky but I think this is the only one that he could find so it's the smoked back bacon eight washers £1.75 I've also got some of Marison's the best 12 pork chipolatas right. do not chipolatas delicious <laughs> then I've got some of these spinach and um, ricotta tortellini. We do like this one, much Oof. Anywho, so I get this as like a quick, easy dish. I make my own pasta sauce of tomatoes, bacon, garlic, mozzarella, Italian herbs, salt, pepper, sometimes a bit of smoked paprika. Um, you just boil these for like two minutes. Add it on the top, a bit of garlic bread. Delicious. Oh. Yum. I'm, lose, I'm losing room. I'm um, running out of room, yeah? Another Marcus purchase. This is the Chicago Town deep dish pepperoni pizzas. Get two of them. I think, I think they're about two quid. Right. Matthew here. Hi Solly, so two packs of Mars, these are two for three fifty. And then one, two, three of these for two pounds fifty. So it actually works out better to get three rather than two. So I've got three. So that's fifteen epics which are just like fabs got rocky some wag treats these are the barbecue bangers so he does love these um wag range for treats marcus picked up some tropical sun peri peri sauce he wants to try that i think that was one pound fifty they were a pound got some of the also oh soft aloe vera ass wipes um these were i think these were about are they like 75p or 85p they're they're, they're, they're lower than a pound anyway because the andrex ones were a pound but I, I do like these um branded ones the aloe ones so yeah that's why i picked myself up some crispy m &Ms. These were £1.25, I think they're on offer, so I've got them. Um, for Marcus Batches, he's got the Carvery Roast Beef. So, I think you get four slices, yeah, four slices of that. So, we'll be having that tomorrow. And then I needed some stain remover because Matthew's got quite an expensive white shirt he wears to work. And it's got a little stain on it, which we don't know what it is, but... I've washed it a few times and I'd run out of um, like whitener stain remover stuff. And just for the tiny, tiny tub of Vanish was £5.70. Or they were doing this Morrison's one for £2.90. And when I checked the ingredients, it's pretty much the same. So I thought I'm going to I'm gonna have a go at this one because, you know, £2.90 and it's 1kg. So, um, the other one was, was half that. So, I'm going to be trying that out. So, £2.90, I think that's quite good for that size. So, yeah, that is everything. So, where's my receipt? Let's have a look. It weren't cheap. I, I didn't think it was going to be, though. So, this week, the total comes to a hundred and seven pounds and 87 pence you see that put it up like that so yes i 
did get quite a few bits. They're all branded stuff. Or some, well, most of them branded, aren't they? So, yeah, we needed a lot. Our fridge is empty. Um, we've still got some things in the freezer, but we needed things like chips and stuff. So, cereal, whatever. And this is what you get for taking your 20-year-old son with you. But when he's with his mum, he acts like a teenager. But anywho, yeah. I feel like I need to burp or something. <clears throat> I do need a drink, I know that. I've just noticed my savings on there was just £2.35, which ain't great. But anywho. So, I'm going to make my chicken wings now. Um, I've already cooked some rice, so I'm going to do like an egg fried rice with it. Like savoury egg fried rice. And some corn on the cobs. That's what we're having for dinner. So, I'm going to get all this away. Get on with dinner. And, yeah, chill out. It's still quite muggy. But it's not been as sunny today. And the temperature has gone down quite a lot. So... I'm quite liking this, being able to breathe. Rocky's a lot better now because he was struggling, bless him. I was just, I was getting a bit worried about him. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Like I said before, give this one a like. Please subscribe to my channel if you're not already and leave me a comment below. Um, please keep it kind. This is a nice, friendly channel. This is, you know, be a part of my YouTube family. We're all really nice on here and supportive and yeah i will see you all soon so hope you've had a lovely day bye